on, our teacher next door, he has a game night. Do you like playing English game? Yes. Do you like playing English game? Yes. Okay, there's a game night. Okay, so every Thursday, hold your hand. Every Thursday it says 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. Not a.m. A.m. you're just a Okay? And it's in W6. Over, where's W6 from? Over there. W6? W6 is not board games. I think 101? 101. So this is in 101. Okay? So you can go every Thursday. Okay? Yes. Yes. Maybe some teachers will give you bonus points. Maybe. Maybe. Not me. Maybe. I have chicken and beer club, so maybe you come and I'll give you more points. But not game club. <laughs>
talk about this as a video right here. I'm going to give you a handout. We're going to discuss in pairs. So I'm going to go pairs, pairs, pairs for the, for the camera. Okay? We're going to talk, take a look at preferences, okay? We're going to talk about this page. We're going to, why or why not? I'm going to give you a marker. You're going to write, why do you change, why not change, okay? Why do you go to the same place? Or why do you like changing place? Then we're going to talk about 68. Okay? So that's what we're going to do today. Any questions? Our break today is 10 minutes. I'm going to put a clock and we're going to take another so we'll start check at the 10 minutes, okay? okay? So be careful. If you go out and have a smoke, maybe you want oh, one more smoke. <laughs> and you come in late, I have to give you minus points, okay? Yeah. So don't do that, okay? So that's all we do. Let's start with the video. Now to the economy and the victims of the recession. Here in New York, thousands of people on Wall Street were laid off, but for some, it meant the opportunity to chase a designing dream. Alexis Christophorus reports. Christine Marchuska has always had a passion for fashion, but never thought she'd see her own name on the label. It's a lot of hard work. You know, I didn't think it was going to happen overnight. I also didn't think, though, that I would have the success that I had. Now this is the dress that I'm wearing. Especially since she came to the fashion world with no experience at all. An Ivy League grad, Marchuska had followed a different path to Wall Street until the credit crisis in 2008 when Morgan Stanley laid off her entire department. After six years in banking, Marchuska was burned out, ready for a fresh start. So she gathered up her savings, took a sewing class, and C. Marchuska was born. So this is made from bamboo. It's an environmentally friendly label using materials like hemp and organic cotton. Everything's made locally and the line reflects her tastes and values. I want to make sure that it included all these different aspects that I'm very passionate about. So fashion, the environment, philanthropy. She sells her clothes online. She has no plans to head back to Wall Street. I wasn't particularly ecstatic 
about finance at the end of my career. I enjoyed it. It was easy to take the page high. Marchusco works harder now and makes less money, but says getting laid off may have opened the door to designing a more fulfilling future. Was change good or bad? Was change for, for that girl? Was change good or bad? Her dream changed. Maybe her dream came true. Yeah, her dream came true. What was another thing that changed in her life? More satisfied. Working for big money, Morgan Stanley. She made big money, but really not happy. So now she's happy. Did she make big money with the change? No? He told me. <laughs> One more time? Yes. Yes. And fill in the top, the first part, okay? Fill in this here, right there. Okay, just here. Yes. We're going to do this. Okay, I'm going to give you some markers. You need a pen? Okay, I'm going to put the captions on. So we should be able to do this. One more time. Now to the economy and the victims of the recession. Here in New York, thousands of people on Wall Street were laid off. But for some, it meant the opportunity to chase a designing dream. Alexis Christophorus reports. Christine Marchuska has always had a passion for fashion, but never thought she'd see her own name on the label. It's a lot of hard work. You know, I didn't think it was going to happen overnight. I also didn't think, though, that I would have the success that I had. Now this is the dress that I'm wearing. Especially since she came to the fashion world with no experience at all. An Ivy League grad, Marchuska had followed a different path to Wall Street until the credit crisis in 2008 when Morgan Stanley laid off her entire department. After six years in banking, Marchuska was burned out, ready for a fresh start. So she gathered up her savings, took a sewing class, and C. Marchuska was born. So this is made from bamboo. It's an environmentally friendly label using materials like hemp and organic cotton. Everything's made locally and the line reflects her tastes and values. I want to make sure that it included all these different aspects that I'm very passionate about. So fashion, the environment, philanthropy. She sells her clothes online. She has no plans to head back to Wall Street. I wasn't particularly ecstatic about finance at the end of my career. I enjoyed it. It was easy to take the page high. Marchusko works harder now and makes less money, but says getting laid off may have opened the door to designing a more fulfilling future. Three. Uh oh. Ah, okay, E. No, that's 
suddenly. Okay? Overnight is very quick. Okay? So, other words, change instant. In an instant is another word. Overnight, very quick. Laid up. Fired. Laid up is not fired. <laughs> Here, the book says fired. Fired is, you are fired! You're a bad, really bad employee. You come late, you don't dress nice, maybe you get angry at the boss. Okay? Laid off means just no contract or not continue your job. So in Canada, we have low oil price. Many people in the oil, refining, drill, trucking, Lots of things about oil. There's no job. No work, no job, you get laid up. So what's another word for this? So laid up, we get? Pink slip. Okay? In English we say, I got a pink slip. Pink slip means this is your last paycheck. Pink slip. Okay? So, laid off, pink slip. We use the same. It's like the last paycheck. No more job. Not bad employee. Fired is bad employee. So, you come to work and you say, You're fired! Donald Trump. Burned out. What is burned out? What is burned out? In the back here. Broken leg man. Tired. Tired. Only tired? What is burned out? Are you burned out? Angry. Not angry. <coughs> Any other ideas? Burned out? Tired or? Disappeared? No. Maybe. Burned out means? Very, very tired. Uh, Only tired a little bit? No, I'm tired. Today I'm tired. Maybe you are tired today. Yeah. But burned out means you're study, 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 and then you have no energy to study. Your friends, come, let's go to change though. No, I want to sleep. I'm burned out. No motivation. No motivation. So, no motivation is I'm tired, I don't want to do it, but no motivation. So you study, 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 study. Now you don't want to study anymore. Not only tired, I don't want to go for beer, but just I don't want to study, I don't want to go for beer, I don't want to do anything, I want to sleep! Okay. Fresh start. What's a fresh start? New beginning. New beginning. In the story, what did she do for a fresh start? I don't know everybody's name yet. What did she do for a fresh start?
Self-clothes? <coughs> she? She. Selling clothes was at the end. She cook. She made you. She made new clothes? Okay, but before that. Okay. Hey. Think about invite to Wall Street. she was on Wall Street, but then she lost her job. What did she do after she lost her job? She? She made new clothes. She made what? Well, she made new clothes, but before she made new clothes, what did she do? Before, before she made new clothes, she went to school. Right? She went to school. She went to school. Right? She went to school to learn how to sew. And in her class, maybe she learned a little design because her dream was, I like fashion, I like to design. Uh, she learned how to sew, now she's... So, she the fresh start was a new direction. Uh, okay? A new direction. She was a Wall Street person with Stanley, you know, with Morgan Stanley. A Wall Street person. That's finance. Now she's in fashion. Not the same. Yes. A fresh start. New beginning. Yeah. Head back to. What's head back to? <laughs> Return. 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 Okay. Head back. If you take your head back. Okay. Where did she head back to? Wall Street. No. Where did she head back to? School. She headed back to school. What does that mean? Back to means, if you say back, go back. Go back means she studied before. She was university before. Yes. Got a job. Now she goes back to school to learn a new idea. Back to. So in the story, in the story, it's back to, back to what? Back to school. First school, she was finance. Second school, sewing. My question, what would you choose as a second career? Pairs, okay? Two. 
Two. Check it out together. Thank you. 